YouTube, Topaz James back for another mixtape review, and this one is to that B.O.B. Fire or false idols ruling egos, his own self-produced fool project and such, man. And this is a sequel to that whole water that we are the enemy, really. And quite honestly, man, I like this project just as much as I liked water. Like, neither of them were like game-breaking, game-changing pieces of music, but yet, overall, we got some solid quality tracks, and then we got some solid concepts and stuff, too, on some real talk that need to be fucking said. Like, off of this project, man, my favorite tracks would be that Bend Over, and which what he's really talking about is how we as a people are so focused on who's fucking who, like all of the gossip bullshit, man, and chasing after all of these chicks, then to realize the truth that we are oppressed as a people. He starts going into the things that's within America that's really not getting highly publicized and shit, like pedophilia, which I touched on in a other video and such, where that's really heavy, especially in LA and shit right now in Hollywood. The ritualistic sacrifices, man, he definitely should have touched on the organ shit that's been going on, like a lot of other us black people get caught up missing and shit and then when we're found all of our organs are fucking taken this is something that has been historically happening to us another track that i liked was that whole false flag in which that's pretty much him saying you really think that these people out here aren't lying to us like they hold the court of law and shit to the highest regard that we're all fucking free and all of that when these motherfuckers is lying and making up shit as they fucking go first they promote false images to us and then when it comes to the court of law man we get hit with 10 times harder sentencing than everybody fucking else. And as a people, we continue to fall for the okie doke. We continue to believe that shit is fair here for some fucking reason. I like that Lights Out track where he pretty much expands on the fact that they're promoting false images and shit to us. And it's to the point that people rather fuck up their money, ruin their fucking lives in order to stunt on somebody else. In order to look like these images that they portray to us, which are completely unreasonable. Something that cannot be sustained. I mean, it keeps us running in a circle of not being able to do shit. Like, you're supposed to take whatever money you get, stack that bitch, put it into your own business, do your own motherfucking thing in order to become self-reliant outside of everybody else. But if you're gonna blow all your money on stunning to get these chicks or anything like that, man, you're fucking yourself in the future. And then I like that action news where he's just going in on the biasness of the fucking media, in which that's something that everybody should have already seen, man. Overall, deep shit, man. I definitely enjoyed this project. I give it a solid 7 out of 10, one that I recommend people to go ahead and download. But this concludes today's review, man. And now we're going to jump into a brief instrumental from underground producer Manny Rod before we jump into the news and then jump into an article from DownloadPass.com. <laughs> putting up 60,000 bottles of water to go out there to Flint, Michigan, man, in which this is the shit that he needs to do because if he wants to talk all of that money shit in order to win battles and shit, he needs to put his money where his fucking mouth is. I honestly believe this gives him the leg up on 50 Cent because can 50 Cent show this kind of money and donate it to fucking Flint, Michigan? See, if 50 Cent could take the battle to Instagram and people consider him killing them with the memes, then Meek Mill killing him with the paper and actually donating some shit that 50 Cent can't do, then quite honestly, you got to give him the leg up here. But mad props to that boy Mick Mill. But anyway, on to today's article from DownloadPass.com. And today's article is about online promotion. Because here's the thing that a lot of rappers and shit need to realize with the mixtapes and all of that shit. One, there's over 400 plus hours of entertainment being uploaded online at all fucking times. And nobody is logging on to the internet to see just you. Like, until you build up your audience, build up your fan base, then you can go ahead and just drop some shit and not do no promotion or anything. But until you get to that point, you got to find a way to reach out to these people. You got to do the grunt work in order to be in front of these people. You can't just drop some shit and think that, okay, it's going to just go viral when that doesn't happen dude like most of these viral videos is because people are paying for it to be viral i hope you enjoyed the show you can follow me at twitter up there and you can go to downloadpads.com that's down there to read today's article